kwa jina ni John Orlando eh, kwa hiyo budget inaona kwamba ina umuhimu wote kwa mwananchi wa kawaida kwa sababu ukiangalia mambo ya ushuru imekuwa juu na ukiangalia ile janga la corona pia limeangamiza sekta ya biashara mbalimbali haswa hii sekta ya bidii nani biashara ndogo ndogo nyinga mvua kawaida sioni kama itanifaidi hiyo budget sababu serikali pia imemeza upinzani ambaye ni wapokoje kuwa serikali kwa hivyo ningependa kwa kwa rai viongozi na viongozi wao chagua wa wapate wa, wa kufanya nini kuipoza serikali ili serikali isiwamize wananchi wa kawaida kama sisi isa uh, Edward Okello I am a teacher at Migori Primary School. So, um, as teachers, we are expecting a lot from the government. Uh, recently, we heard that the government had not factored uh, teachers' pay into the budget. And uh, as we are uh, speaking right now, we expected the government to increase salaries to teachers, especially classroom teachers. Yeah. In the past, um, in the last CBA, we the the, the, the beneficiaries of the of the pay increment were mostly administrators, senior teachers, deputies, and head teachers. Classroom teachers did not benefit much. So we were highly expecting that uh, the government would consider classroom teachers in this budget and uh, give them a pay rise. Because right now there is a lot of work with teachers. With the coming CBC, teachers are engaged in 24 7. Teachers are expected to uh, implement this new curriculum to the latter, being that it is a new curriculum. Teachers need to work very hard for its implementation to start on a good note. And with this, teachers have a lot of work to nurture these young children, nurture their talents, and uh, give this new system a head start. As a pay rise, so that we can also be happy as teachers. Otherwise, um, we are uh, a little bit more disappointed the government uh, Budgeting as far as teachers are concerned. Yes, sir. Actually, we are, as a taxpayer, we are not very really happy. Because uh, right now, life is very difficult. Uh, COVID 19 affected many um, ordinary citizens financially. Many ordinary citizens lost their jobs, many lost their businesses. And now there is heavy taxation. So how does the government expect the ordinary man to survive? We expected that this government would ease the burden which is already there as far as tax is concerned. So that us, people who are at the lowest level, can also enjoy life. We are not very happy. Yes. One, the, uh, the projected budget is over in my view, it ought to have been lower than what is projected. Reason being, uh, we have the problem of COVID and these are the issues. Our economy is not capable of meeting that way. Secondly, we are burdened by debts that we have at the moment. So, the debt burden alone take a chunk of this budget and I think the government should be some of the projects that uh, it has identified. There are some of the projects that it can reserve uh, in, so that uh, you don't have a, a budget that overburden the common man. There's a likelihood that prices of basic commodities uh, then, also then, then uh, the prices of the commodities will obviously go up because one when when the budget is so large and the number of taxpayers or the, 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 the taxpayers who are able to meet this budget are a few 
obviously the, the, the product uh, that is the cost of products will go up. So what would be your, your advice to the government? Now my advice to the government one it should consider innovative tax approaches so that it can it can engage so many people in, in raising the, 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 the taxes that can be support any budget. Presently so many Kenyans are not paying taxes. Not because they don't want to pay taxes, but because the economy, that is the, the tax regime of this country is not favorable for them. I feel that if, if the country can lower the taxes, many people will venture into businesses and it can spread the taxes of this also apprehensive that uh, our input as taxpayers might not be taken into consideration given that the government has been doing this before, it has been coming up with over ambitious budgets and it overburdens the taxpayers. So this time round it is important that they share some of the items which we do not necessarily need, especially now that we have been ravaged by COVID. Thank you.